Hello and welcome to Xenoblast. It's a new game in which I'll just go through the uh, the blurb on the back of the box. I've, I've not got the original box, but uh, you can buy it for six pounds on cassette, which is the kind of price you would get this kind of game on the Spectrum in the 80s. Um, but yeah, a price that was a good price. Sometimes you get like Imagine games, which were well, Imagine, no Imagine. I was going to say Magic for a minute, but that was Atari. Imagine where they're charging like £8, it wasn't quite worth it. Sometimes the ultimate ones will be £10. Quite frankly, they, they weren't always worth it. Gunfright was particularly bad. Um, yeah, £6, that was a perfect price just to pay, you know, if you had pocket money and you just wanted to spend it on something that uh, you thought you'd enjoy. So, 200 years into the future, humans have peacefully colonised deep space. Things have taken a dark turn as recent Xeno discoveries... Is it Xeno or Xeno? I don't know. Uh, have turned hostile. News reaches the HQ alien life... Oh, sorry, there's no comma here. News reaches HQ that alien life forms have overtaken several human colonies in the outer region. And you are amongst the best pilots to repel their offensive. Xenoblast, Xenoblast, let's call the whole thing off, puts you in charge of a Class 2 defense ship, an agile fighter with the weaponry to take on the hostile aliens. Guide your ship safely through the colonies, destroying as many Xeno fighters, Xeno Xeno, as possible. And remove the motherships, delivering alien drones to the human colonies. So along the way, make sure you you collect as many power pods as possible. These will recharge your smart bomb. But more importantly, enable the portal to hyper jump into the next zone at the end of the level. Take on hordes of alien ships through seven levels of arcade shoot 'em up action and liberate the colonies before it's too late. Good luck. So uh, I sort of read that out without sort of taking it in, but it's basically shoot everything and uh, yeah, get rid of the motherships. Uh, collect the power pods, and then um, hopefully uh, smart bomb everything to hell. QAOP moves to ship, space, or fire. S for smart bomb. I used to use QAOPM on the Spectrum because uh, M was you know, kind of where space is now, but then again, I'm, I'm a Billy Big Hands now, Mulder. So, uh, yeah. Let's uh, let's go key. Get QAOP. Yeah, let's go. Can kill that. It's a bit like um, Xevious. It's uh, an old arcade game. I'm presuming that's something I need to pick up. Yep, good. That's the kind of thing that's going to make me think I'm going to be doing really well. Oh, bugger. Yeah, it just <laughs> makes me think I'm going to be doing really well, and then I'll just die. And as I said, I was just about to say that, I then died. Yep, try not to bash into the furniture. That tends to hurt. Ah! Oh, I'm not going to do very well at this, am I? Hang on, hang on. Let's um, let's really use a smart bomb, shouldn't I? Let's wait until there's there's lots of them. And I can't escape. Yes, 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 yes. Shooting willy nilly. I like that guard in uh, Die Hard with a Vengeance when he was about to get his neck slashed open by the mute singer. Yep, Sam Phillips. She's a singer by trade. And um, for some reason she never spoke in. Uh, Why well, she never spoke in the film, I no idea, but they just uh, made it so that she, such that the character was uh, mute instead. Use the smart bomb here. Oh, it didn't work on him, did it? Big bugger. Come on, you bugger. I oh, do I have to get up to the top? Oh, well, maybe that's the trick. Because he's not sort of dying anytime soon. Let's... I think, yes, yes. Oh, area two. I think so. There was like seven, seven levels. Is this is this level two or is this um, is this area two of level one? I don't know. Oh, I can't get across. 
You evil bugger. Ah, oh, I'm not going to do that anytime soon. Ah! Bastard. Oh, is that all? Three... Three goes. Let's have a go again. Sound like you burp then. Area 1. I presume it's seven areas. I'm sure some will... Let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you think. Yes. No idea how many smart bombs I've got though. I thought that sort of thing bottom uh, bottom right where you got four things, four dots, that was like telling me how many smart bombs I had, but no. Anyway, so the, the Guardian um, died with a vengeance who had his throat cut. He, uh, yeah, he just fired, fired, fired in the hope that uh, it would get rid of the baddies, but uh, no, because they were standing out of the way. Ah. And uh, so he died. I can use a smart bomb, but I don't feel like saving them. Just the biggest threat for me, of course, was the bloody um, banging into the furniture. <clears throat> Let's get past Big Bertie there. Ah! Should have used a damn smart bomb. Buggeration. Made up for it there. What if we can get extra levels, extra lives elsewhere later on? Who knows? Oh, so you see, I could do a thing where I'm just, I'll just save each level as I go, but I'm just doing a, a run through of as far as I get with this. Just, uh, not trying to 100% it. Ah, have to use another one there. Just want to give you a flavour of the game. Oh, I ooh, can I get one there? Ooh. Die, die. Yeah, it's just giving you a flavour of the game here. Ooh. It's manoeuvring through the damp furniture that's the uh, problem. Doing it in time. Oh! Yep. Ah! Oh. How many of these have I got? Ah, missed the damn thing. <sighs> Had to use one there as well. Oh! Ah, come on, you bugger. Oh! It's like I use a smart bomb to get a smart bomb, or so it feels. Oh! Oh, 
Oh, come on! <laughs> oh shit, I've run out of fucking spark bombs as well. Oh! And that, ah, I thought I was going to have to go up, down, left, right and all the rest of it. Well, uh, you're not... Oh, come on! You absolute bugger. <clears throat> okay, it'd be nice if when you... <coughs> excuse me. If when you do that, it will, um... Not put you on top of the furniture. I, I keep using the word furniture, I don't... <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> I know it's not furniture, but you get the idea. But, uh, <laughs> Let's, um... Let's have a third go at that and, uh... See how far we get, because I think... With that, with that time, I just uh, I thought it was gonna I was gonna have to sort of go left while uh, you know while the thing scrolled upwards, and obviously it didn't in the end. But uh, yeah, and then I completely I just lost two the last two uh, things on the bounce. So, yeah, it's gonna be one of those games that's, that's easy to pick up and play, but difficult to master. And your nerves are getting frayed by the end of it because uh, it just kills you time and time again, and you can't get past it. No, that lots and lots and lots of practice. But that's what that's what arcade games are meant to be about. They're not meant to be games where you just complete them first time round. Otherwise, what's the point? Now, I wonder if the... Oh, something on the bottom there. Oh! Got him! Not even looking where I'm going. Again, that sort of puts you on top of the furniture when you regenerate. <laughs> I don't know where those are counting up on the screen. I can't see them at all. There's a couple of crosses at the bottom. I thought they might be the... Uh, Smart bombs, but they're not. <sighs> I'll wait till he goes again. Come on, big bursty out of the way. Made a dangerous manoeuvre of trying to uh, steer my ship from danger while drinking from a cup of tea. So I took to the left there of uh, to get the smart bomb. Oh, there's, there's one on the right anyway. I could always go to the right. Be like the BBC. Forever going to the right, pretending. Pretending no one noticed. <laughs> Little build pole. What? Bastard! He came out from the left hand side! Oh! Oh! Almost died then. That that kind of needs fixing, I'd say. Oh! Smart bump. Yeah, coming out from the left. That's, that's, that's mean. That's really mean. Oh, you... Oh... <sighs> Alright, right. Definitely... Yeah. Definitely one last go. <laughs> That's the trouble. One last go. One last go. One last go. Before you know it, you sat, you sat here for hours trying to beat the damn thing. When, at the time I'm recording this, it's uh, Sunday lunchtime and I really want to go and have some, uh, you know, lunch. Seeing these, some of these aliens, I feel like having jammy dodgers for lunch. What are you having for lunch? Let me know in, in the comments below. I like 
I like chicken kebs on a Sunday. I've kind of never never got out of the mentality of when I was a student and just having one thing every Sunday, one thing every one thing every Monday and Tuesday and yeah. Roughly, roughly. Sometimes I change it up a bit, but quite often it's, it's the same kind of thing. It's just easier. Saves me having to think. Some cool music in this. I might play uh, play the play it over the um, on the video after after I die on this playthrough. Pardon me. Right, area two. So I'm, I'm, I would hazard a guess it's seven areas. If you had to use three ships over you know, mul you know, multiple levels made up of several areas. It would never, you'd never do it. I wonder if anyone can actually beat the whole thing in one sitting. That'd be interesting. <coughs> That's just where I died last time. Oh, I've run out of friggin' smart bombs. Shite. Oh, that's where I died before. I soon passed. Is that, so is that one circular thing per smart bomb? Yeah, it probably is. I wish I knew where it damn counted them though. Maybe there are some things man ain't meant to know. Yeah, get rid of them with that. Oh! You bloody moron. Uh, at least that thing's not shooting at me. It's a little bit easier, but... Oh, oh, Christ. So I don't have to be too exact with that, so that's, uh, that's a plus. So if I can shoot through it, I can, uh, I can travel through it. Oh, run out of freaking smart bombs, bastards. Come on, you fuckers, get out of the way. <clears throat> you have to keep pressing space, you can't just hold space down. Ah! Fucking hell. Ooh. Uh, come on, you buggers out my bloody way. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Jesus. This is not easy. Right, so it does stop. Let's get to the right hand side so I'm in the right position. Be easy either way. Shitty balls. Come on. Uh, let's just learn the pattern of where he goes, I guess. Goes down like that. So if I can just sort of shake past him. Okay. Oh! Right. Do not expect me to get past this level, that's for sure. Oh, shooty Rama! I nearly died. It was a damn hard to, to kill. Seems to take about twice as many hits.
Stick to the left, unlike the BBC. <laughs> can I go? Can I go through the eight words of Area Four? No, I can't. Can't shoot through them, so I presume I can't. Yeah, travel through them. Ah! Oh. <laughs> I was trying to use a smart bomb, but not got any. Oh, Christ almighty. Oh, please tell me it stops. Shit. Oh, God. Oh, well, this might be where I die, but I can see I can go up there. Safely. Then I've got to get. No. Okay. So after he goes next time, I'm going to try and make a break for it. Ah! All right. Last chance saloon. Smart bomb won't help me now. Oh, flipperama. <sighs> oh, man. That was good fun, but um, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to call it a day there because uh, my nerves are shot now. And I need to go and uh, have some lunch and some booze. I demand to have some booze. No, it's lunchtime. I'm not going to have booze. Anyway, let me know all your thoughts in the comments below. I really enjoyed that. Uh, in the meantime, please like this video, share it with your friends, and subscribe if you haven't already. Click on the bell for all the notifications, and I'll play uh, you know, the music. And after that, we'll cue Genesis. Hang on.